Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and I've got a Dollar Tree haul for you. And yes, I'm still wearing my elf shirt. I'm videoing these back to back, my Target and my Dollar Spot. Still drinking my hot tea. It is from the tea, Republic of Tea Apple Cider. For the price of it, I wouldn't recommend it. It's $15. I ordered it online. It was expensive. And for this size cup, it takes three tea bags. That's a lot. I would go with uh, Bigelow or Lipton even or um, Twining. Just a thought. All right. I'm not going to be chatty Cathy because this is a big one. Let's get started, shall we? I'll show you my favorite item. Guys, this is gigantic. It comes with this bow. I don't care for the bow. I love this jar and I'm doing my house and buffalo check. So I'm kind of leaning towards reds and blacks. So I'll probably get a buffalo check ribbon to put on here. I'm going to put some greenery and this is going to go in my bathroom downstairs. I have a little tiny spot that I can put something on my bathroom sink and that's where this is going to go. And I love it. So I grabbed that, and for a dollar, you can't beat it. Um, also, on the glass front, and I hope you can see this. Do you see the deer in the winter scene? It's got just a little bit of gold, and it is definitely raised, so it's 3D. And I grabbed just a dollar candle, which I feel like this is from the fall collection. Even though it's cinnamon, it has a fall leaf on it. So I think it's from the fall collection. It smells okay, but I'm putting that candle in it and decorating with that because I just love it. And I'll, I like candles all, all the time. Um, I grabbed these boxes. Look at this. It's got a different shape to it. This is going to be perfect for gift giving. Um, candies, little things, just easy. Tie it up. You don't even have to decorate it. Or wrap it and then I got this size too you could even put I bet you a, a loaf of small loaf of bread would fit in here they may have a bigger size or this may be the biggest I can't remember but um, I grabbed two of these and I just love the snowman on the front I just love him and this color this green um, and this is a Greenbrier product and they are gift box but again I think I mentioned in my target I just don't like losing little gifts and as your kids get older, the presents get smaller. You can even throw a gift card in here. Uh, do your hot chocolate kit. Put a gift card. All things. So I grabbed that. Two of those to decorate with. Um, I grabbed just some of this ribbon because I thought it was super cute. And it says, the elves made me do it. <laughs> I just thought this was adorable. You get, I think, nine feet three yards, nine feet of ribbon. It's cute. I liked it. I thought it was sweet. Um, for DIY coming up, I grabbed two of these mops. Um, you don't need, I don't think I need two. And I took the pole off. I'll just throw that away. It unscrews. I'm going to be deconstructing this thing. And I think to make two of the gnomes, I'm going to make a gnome. Uh, one would be enough unless you want it to go all the way around, which I don't. Um, I recommend opening it and kind of letting it air out. It had a weird smell when it first came out of the um, packaging, but now it does not. I've had it out for a couple weeks. So I grabbed a mop. Because random. Um, Householdy stuff. I love this parchment paper. It's great. I do a lot of baking and cooking on it. It just keeps my pots from getting overly gross. Um, and this is 25 feet, which isn't bad. It's a good quality. So I grabbed that um, for the gnomes. I grabbed a bag of rice. You can obviously eat it. I don't eat rice, but for a dollar, it makes a good weight. And I'll show you how I'm going to do it. But I have a video coming out, or it has already come out one way or the other. You'll see how I make a Dollar Tree gnome. Um, for my Christmas tree that I'm decorating for work, I grabbed some of this mini garland. It's 20 feet. And it has little stars. I think this will be perfect just to add a little sparkle to my work mini Christmas tree that I got at the Dollar Tree. It's for that. Look at this gift card holder. Isn't that adorable? No, it's a 10. 
I, although you can use this as a gift card holder, I don't. Um, it even has a little place in here that will hold your gift card for you, the little plastic insert, which I think is amazing. Um, but what I will use this for in my knitting or, yeah, probably in my knitting, in my Christmas knitting bag, to hold my little notions. It'll hold like my stitch markers and a needle and things that I need to keep while I'm working on a knitting project and I keep them in these little tins. Any little tin will work, but I just find it festive. And it was $1 and it has a red truck. And it says Merry Christmas and it's just amazing and it's awesome and it will be fun. So that's in my knitting bag. <laughs> I did pick up some of these gift tags. Now I make my own, but this had the red truck. It has the um, poinsettia, which I'm really digging this year. And it has the penguin and a snowman. And you get two of each. And what's fun is these little pieces pop off. And I think there's a print behind it. But I think I will use these to decorate maybe my planner. Or I can use them as gift tags. You get 18 pieces. Um, I do make my own gift tags, but these are fun too. And I just thought... I really like the campers and the red truck. Oh, and the cart. I just like it all. And Santa Claus. But on Santa Claus, it's just his beard that is 3D, so that won't work. But on everybody else, it'll be fun. Actually, I could use these when I do my Christmas gifting at work. I could use these as the tags for that. Because I will have a video coming up on that on this year I'm gifting candy to all my coworkers. I picked up two of these because, um, yeah, these are at my CVS $3.99. Now, they had some hair ones on clearance. But anyway, this is Skin Recharging, Recharging Greek Yogurt and Probiotics, but it's an eye mask. It goes around your eyes, so I'm excited to try that. I get tired eyes here. I mean, I could use scotch tape, I suppose, but <laughs> I grabbed two of these. These are for me. I want to try them out and see how they are. I don't love the Yes2 products um, for the full face because my skin is really sensitive, but I'm thinking just for my eyes. Um, it has super blueberries, Greek yogurt, and probiotics to smooth and de-stress. So I'm going to try one of these tonight. So that's exciting. I thought those were super fun. Um, in my last video, I said I was going to use the rubber plastic cookie containers for my planner stuff for December, but then I found this. And this is what all my planner stuff, just my Christmas themed planner stuff. This is a big box, guys. It came, when I picked it up, it had all of the little ones in it. And it came in like five or six different sizes, um, which I don't need. But look at, even on the inside, it's decorated. I mean, come on, Dollar Tree. You're killing me here. Just, again, the detail. I can go to Michael's or Joanne and buy this box in this size for three or four or five dollars and it's empty and plain on the inside. But to just carry over the design on the inside of the box in the trees, I just think it's awesome. And then the lid is, you know, this beautiful red with the candy cane striping going around. It's perfect. And this will hold all of my planner stuff for December because I typically do my planner but then i also have all kinds of other stuff that i do in december to keep myself organized so having it all in one place and then this will just get put away and then when christmas time rolls around next year i pull it out and i have all of my holiday themed planner stuff together and i don't have to remember what i have and all that because i have it and the reason i'm switching it over i don't know what i did with my stickers i moved them over there but this will hold the sheets of stickers where the other one will not that's why i switched it up also besides uh, look at it and i will probably put like a sticker here that just says planner so i remember um what that is i also have another diy coming up using um these are the garland wired garland ties you get a dozen in here. Let me see if I have it over here. I do. I showed you in another video. You can take one and make a little wreath out of it. Um, or you could do two together and make bigger wreaths and hang these on like doors. This would actually hang right on a doorknob and you could hang things from it. Um, but what I'm going to make I think is a garland, but we'll see. But I like the idea also of having this on my doorknob and then hanging some bells from it, which I already have. 
uh, Target, the dollar spot, they had something similar. Um, it was like three or five dollars. But so these go pretty quickly at my store. So I grabbed two and I had already had one that I opened up. So that gives me a nice amount of these to work with, depending on what project I come up with. But for sure, I want to make a wreath garland for my mantle. So that is what these are for. So if you think you would like to work along with me on that, you definitely want to pick those up. If you can tell, I'm suffering with a cold. And I picked up these, what's it called? These Breeze Easy, Easy Personal Diffusers. And I've seen people hauling them, and I found them in my store. This is the one I need. Oh, wait, this one is Breathe Easy. That's what this one is called. And it has eucalyptus, peppermint, pine, rosemary. I can smell it through here, but you open it up and there's a little hole in the top. Oh, like it honestly, I can smell it and it kind of just makes my head feel like it's opening. Mmm, it smells so good. And I can feel the menthol like on the back of my throat, which is nice. So I grabbed just this one and it comes like that. I've already been using it while I'm sitting here. I'm like... I also have Vicks tissues, but I did not buy those at the Dollar Tree. Um, oh, yes. So I mentioned on a couple videos we're doing a gingerbread decorating kit at house day with my cousin's little friends. And I grabbed one more package of the gingerbread. So we'll have eight gingerbread men to utilize for decorating. I think we could just stand them in the front yard. And for me, I got a Christmas tree to put in my front yard on mine. Let's see if I can open it. So you can see, ouch, yes, I can't, it's actually comes like it's supposed to be a tree ornament or something. It's packed, wrapped in pack plastic. It is a candy cane Christmas tree. So I would just put some glue on the bottom, stand it in the front yard of my gingerbread house and maybe add some more snow or sparkles to it. I'm not getting all the girls one because I don't know if they would like that, but I definitely wanted one for my house, so I grabbed it, which I need to keep all that stuff separate. Um, yes. I found the stocking, and I decided my Christmas tree needed a stocking friend. Again, I have no need in my life for this other than this. It's so soothing, and I'm telling you, these are nice quality. This is really nice. It's not cheap felt. This is nice. Um, you know, if I was giving it to a child, I may open it up at the top and stuff some more filling in it. But quite frankly, you could attach this to a front of a pillow and make like 3D pillows. It's that cute and that sparkly and just that little bit of something. I don't know what I'm going to do with them, but I have this one and I have the Christmas tree. I didn't really like the star, so I didn't get that one, but I like this one. I might just set them on my bed because, well, they're sparkly. I love them. So I did find that. Um, I got a pack of these top baggies for packing lunches. You get 25. <laughs> Honestly, I've already opened them and used some for some uh, wool that I have to store behind me. In the... Oh, it's down there. You can't see it. But I took them out and I put some the different colors of wool to keep them separated and keep my cats out of it. These are nice. I mean, they're not the best quality, but they're super cute and they have all different prints. And this one has coffee cups on it, which is me. So I grab that and I'll put it in my kitchen cabinet. And when it's time to pack my lunches in December, I will have these for that. I only found one of these little cable chargers and I don't really know what it's all about. I think this is a Chihuahua. It says it's to help keep your cords from getting, from pulling on your cords. And I think the one in my car is what I did to it. Um, for my car, I need a data cable so that I can play my music and my books through my stereo system. And so this, he opens up here. And you feed your cord into it, and then it attaches to the bottom of your phone. So we'll see if it works. On my, <laughs> it opens up like here, and you can stuff your cord in there to protect it. We'll see how it works. I'm gonna try it. 
I've already had to order a new data cord for my car. I don't have a cable out here. Oh, I do. Oh, I don't think that's going to work on my phone. I mean, I can get it onto the cable, but this is how wide my charger is. And I don't feel like that's going to work. It was a dollar, so it's fine. I don't really know whose phone this is supposed to fit. I mean, I, okay, yeah. See, here's the problem. My cord is so wide. I guess I could put it here and just make sure I grab this to pull it out. But I feel like I'm supposed to be grabbing this to pull it out and not this. Um, but the mouth is attached to that. So we'll try and see. If not, I just wasted a dollar. Not a big deal. I found two more pieces of candy, and this is it for the candy, guys. Have you in your life seen an Andy's Candies candy bar? It's called a snap bar. What? Look at that. I mean, that is perfect. So I grabbed one of those, and then this is Russell Stover. It's called Itty Bitty Chocolate Santas. They're just little tiny chocolate Santas in a bag. I mean, I know it's not focusing, sorry. Let me try moving my head and see. Nope. Anyway, and this has, it says somewhere it has like 16 or 30 little mini Santas, but it's just a bag of candy. And guys, you know I'm obsessed this year with the candy. So this will go in my candy box over here and it will be gifted to folks at my office. All right, I grabbed two of these, and these are these are actually gift bag sacks, um, and I have some need for them. This one has snowflakes, and this one says just different Christmas words. Um, I would grab these if you see them, if you plan on doing any kind of gift basketing. Um, they get two in a package. I did find one more of these. Super excited. Now I have two. Um, part of a gift that I'm giving, which I will share my gift guide, I grabbed a sketchbook. I have a nephew that loves to draw, and I have built him a gift, and he needed some paper to go with it. And I needed some gift boxes. And I thought these were fun uh, to actually wrap his gift in. I don't do a lot of gift boxing. All right, we're getting to the end here. I found, so my work we're doing... Um, like adopt a family. So I found this, it's a um, children's place shirt. And it's like a skateboarder for a boy. I thought that was adorable. And we don't know the sizes or anything. They're giving it to a group of kids. And this says, I'm not bossy, I'm the queen. It's a little girl, just a little long sleeve shirt. I mean, they're a dollar. And on that same realm, I grabbed these two color forms. Do you remember color forms? Because I sure do. Uh, and this is for Frozen 2 that's coming out this year. And I thought, how fun is that? So I grabbed two of those. And it comes with 40 sticker or 40 of these replaceable clings. And then your boards to show them. So I grabbed that. And then all these are for the same stuff to take in I grabbed the frozen this is sprinkle soap and it looks like snowflakes this is also from frozen 2 and it's cotton candy scented snowflakes and then I got the matching um, bath bomb so I thought for some little girl you know even if they just do one of those that would be a fun little something you know just Thing. We're doing we're taking donations for two months, so I'm just grabbing things while I see them. I grabbed a bag of lentils. This is also for gnomes, different size gnomes. I grab men's socks for the gnomes in black. You can do any color you like. Um, I just like the men's socks, and this also comes with two sets, so that I could do four gnomes. But I'm doing the black because it will match my decor. Uh, for my little Christmas tree, I grabbed a star. It is gold. And it's glittery. And some bows. These are for um, the wreaths that I'm going to make the garland out of. So if you want to do that along with me. And the last thing I picked up, sorry I'm speeding along, but guys, I'm at 20 minutes of chit chat. I grabbed another one of these mugs. I'm obsessed. I love these mugs at Christmas time. Let me tell you, I... 
This one just has the bitten, so it'll go through winter time. But I use these all the time. They hold a fair amount of hot coffee, and then I kind of toss them away sometimes if they get gross. The only issue is I would not put it in the dishwasher, and you want to watch the seal. The reason I end up tossing them is because there's a seal in here that sometimes falls out, and I lose it, and then your cup will spill all over you. All right, so that is everything. I hope you enjoyed, and I will talk to you later. Bye. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. Bye, guys.